Weather did not get in the way of our breaking news tonight. A success for SpaceX. Ignition and liftoff of the Falcon 9 rocket and the Dragon spacecraft. On the heels of the we brought it to you live on News 6 at 6. Despite some clouds in the forecast, the SpaceX Falcon 9 took off on time for a cargo mission to the International Space Station. And about eight minutes later, SpaceX successfully landed the flight proven first stage on land at the Cape. They're starting to make these things look routine. Did you hear that? The sonic boom. News 6 reporter James Barvero shows us what it looked like to be there in person. Last minute dramatics from SpaceX, like last night, this launch attempt came down to the final minute, and tonight it was worth the wait. Weather, bad weather, dissipating right before our eyes, what turned out to be a beautiful launch and a spectacular landing. And the of the Tonight, SpaceX's 18th resupply mission to the International Space Station is also the 20th flight for its Cargo Dragon spaceship. In two days, this particular Dragon is expected to dock with the space station for a third time. This week, like its ISS logos, SpaceX also put an Apollo sticker on Dragon to commemorate the 50th anniversary of Apollo 11. This launch delayed 24 hours because of weather. Notice the sharp contrast between the skies at the Cape we recorded yesterday and right now. Weather officials upgrading the launch forecast from 30% favorable conditions to 50-50. Ultimately, a great start to the mission, including a stunning launch from Pad 40 and a sonic boom landing at LZ-1. At Cape Canaveral, I'm James Sparvero, getting results, News 6. Now, this is the first Dragon capsule to ever make three flights to the International Space Station. You can see two stamps of the ISS on one side, the other a logo honoring the 50th anniversary of Apollo 11.